Cool plays, bro. We go through the best plays of the week. Week seven is officially behind us. Woo! And that means it's time to break out the starter jacket, show you all the logos and the best innovative stuff that we saw. Let's start off in the desert. We're talking about Thursday night football, Packers versus Cardinals. Let's appreciate just how good the Cardinals offense is going right now. Here's Kyler. I, I challenge you to find a more impressive play than this one on third and 23 between Kyler and his receiver. Watch Kyler Murray here, dancing around, dancing around. Look at all this. He's got number four, Rondell Moore, wide open. But he takes this shot here to A.J. Green and threads the needle perfectly. Mm. This is not the easy throw. It's the hard one, and it's a perfect one. Rondell would have gone for 10 yards. That's fine. I'm going to go to A.J. Green for 30 instead. And then A.J. Green, who has been more than just a ceremonial veteran, but has been a major player on this team, makes the play. All right, play number two. Kyler's magic in the pocket. Watch what this guy can do. The pass rush is coming. One, two, no. three. And then, are you serious? Wow. Who throws like this? Look the rest. It's a perfect pass. DeAndre Hopkins, move the chains. Hopkins, meanwhile, look at the route, okay? Look, I'm open, I'm open, I'm open. Wait, 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 he needs me, he needs me, he needs me, he needs me. I'm gonna come back, I'm gonna come back. Knows where he's at, makes the play, gets out of bounds. He's smiling, he knows. Yeah. It's special what they're doing, all right? That smile right there. That's not even the best play. To me, it was the, the addition of the new guy. Okay, first we got the man in motion. Is that gonna come where all these linebackers are like, what's he doing, what's he doing, no. All right, and then watch this. Got here last week, let's get him the rock. That's Zach Ertz, that's a great catch by Zach Ertz. Yeah, it was. Watch him after the catch. Two players chasing him, three players chasing him. Good block by the receiver right there, Christian Kirk. Zach Ertz, you add this player to an offense that was already sizzling. This team's for real. The, the big if is yeah. if Kyler can stay healthy. If right. Kyler can stay healthy, this won't stop. Look at these guys. This is just three of them. We're not even including Christian Kirk or uh -huh. Rondell Moore. Career receptions, active players. DeAndre Hopkins is third. AJ Green is sixth. Zach Ertz is tied for 14. That's incredible. Those are all on an offense, and there's more options after that. Ertz said after the game, I've never seen so much green grass in my life. That was there's so many guys that yeah. it's hard for a defense to cover and account for, and they're all so selfless and playing so well as a team. This Cardinals team is special. I really do believe it, and I think we're going to see it on Thursday night. Another team that is special? How about the 5-2 and two Las Vegas Raiders? Kay Adams is wearing the shirt today. Woo -woo! Let's give them their love in cool plays, bro. This team could have fallen apart. This quarterback could have fallen apart. There were plenty of reasons why. Instead, they have routed off two straight wins, and this quarterback has only gotten better. Yeah, I'm talking about Derek Carr. Here he does. He's got Hunter Renfro open. He wants Zay Jones. Look at this pass by Carr. It's exquisite. Mm -hmm. It's perfect. And Zay runs a great route. We know Zay Jones' story. Was in mm -hmm. Buffalo, had some issues, comes back, has been reignited out here in Las Vegas as yeah. a key receiver and a part of this offense. Great catch, great play, great throw by Derek Carr. And then there's this one. All right, play action to Kenyon Drake. Look at this. The pass rush is coming. It's right in his face. Carr adjusts the way he throws the ball. Trust Foster Moreau. And look at it from this angle. Moreau's not exactly open there, but he puts it there, and Moreau just mosses the dude. We're in. And then there's this one. Are you serious? Max Crosby's like 6'5", 280. Bad Max. This guy is just hinting at it. He's like, I'm coming in. I'm making this play. He just leaps over the, the uh, at the line of scrimmage, makes the play. I don't think it's hyperbole to say we've seen this before. Bring I, it. I might be more impressive with this one than the one that gets all the love. Here we go, fourth and one in obviously an AFC championship game. Joe Flacco's trying to get in and Troy Palomalo does the Palomalo leap. This one right here was basically like, I know I'm a couple years into my career. I'm going to the Hall of Fame first ballot. Look what I do in an <laughs> AFC championship game. Jumping over the line of scrimmage, did it again against the Titans one yeah. time, and Kerry Collins was that quarterback. That's what Max Crosby did, and that's what the Raiders have going on right now. They're five and two. Show us that logo on your left arm. It is Where are they at? They're there right we here. go. I don't think they're going away anytime soon. I don't Give think so. Look at him. This is what he did. Palomalu, yeah. I'll take Crosby too. Raiders. All right. And for the first time on this segment, and the first time as a show in maybe three years. We're going to show some Giants cool plays, bro, because God. they went bro. deep into the playbook, and we got Daniel Jones making maybe the catch of the week. Here it is, the pass from Dante Pettis, and Daniel Jones one-handed and takes the punishment. Take a look at it again. It's not just that he caught a pass. It's one-handed, and he takes a licking. Mm -hmm. mm. Gets right back up. 
All right, so Sick we said this yesterday. Kyle, you mentioned this. This is a great one too. Let's go to the cool plays. Okay, Odell, we love that one. Of course, it was one of the greatest catches in NFL history. It was the Odell, wow. still amazing. Collinsworth says, that might be the best catch I've ever seen. I go to this one though, Sean. This is the Super Bowl team, the second one here. Manningham in the clutch, the toe drag on the sideline, kept his feet inbounds. This one moved the chains. They would obviously go on and get the Ahmad Bradshaw touchdown score that would put them in the lead. But maybe the greatest ever. And look at that center right there, number it 60. Is. Number 60 is working his butt off right here. I'm not even watching this guy. Look at 60. Look, look at, at 60. Seymour. Yeah. And David Tyree with the helmet catch moves the chains, of course, over Rodney Harrison. The Giants have had some really special catches in the last 20 years, some really great ones. The best one ever was this one, though. Yeah, Show it again. Yeah, DJ. Show it again. ODJ. You can have your Odell. You can have your Manningham. You so can have impressive. your Tyree. And his non-essential Super Bowl cat. Who cares in the Super Bowl? This was a week six game against the Panthers. <laughs> Daniel Jones, all kidding aside, awesome catch, tough as nails. And I think a lot of people have been trying to ride him out of town. I think Daniel Jones has done a pretty fine job as the quarterback of the New York Giants. I missed a lot of stuff this year. Is he criminally Giants. underrated? Yeah, I don't know if he's criminally underrated. I do think he might be underappreciated at times, and that athleticism is part of what they see every day. Sean O'Hara, you were the center on the Tyree catch. You look a little different in those, in those plays. You look great right now. It really does. Tell us. What did you make of the Daniel Jones catch? Yeah, it probably looked like uh, if you threw a jersey on over that jacket right there, that's what I looked like. This is it. Marshmallow Man. And some phenomenal catches, but all those receivers, that's what that got paid to do, to catch the ball. Daniel Jones doesn't get paid to catch the ball, so I'm with you, man. That was remarkable. And I'll say this. If three weeks ago you would have told me Jason Garrett was going to have played right? on this segment right there, mm. I, I don't know if I would have that. So shout out to Jason Garrett. Adapt. What do you got, Kyle? Peter's going to get big fonted on Instagram for saying that Daniel Jones has done a pretty fine <laughs> job as the Giants quarterback. Peter with a scathing commentary. <laughs> Great catch. Great catch. An exquisite catch. Okay, exquisite Drake, catch. call somebody out. Who haven't you seen on Cool Play? We're week eight, baby. I gotta Halfway be honest. Out. I gotta be honest. It's time for the Kansas City Chiefs. Let's to wake go. Up, dust off the cobwebs. This segment was made for the Kansas City Chiefs, and I'm not talking about Mahomes left-handed throwing it out of bounds. Yeah. I'm talking about the old school Chiefs when they used to pound teams and light it up through the air. Andy, the enemy. Come on, guys. Let's Bro. go. Let's go. Bro. Cool Play's Road.